Nottingham Forest close in on signing Dean Henderson. What's going on guys? Welcome back to a little short video. Uh, before we get into it, if you'd like to subscribe, I'm nearly at 1,000 subscribers and it would mean a lot. Also drop a like on the video, it really, it really helps the channel. And yeah, let's get into it. So it's been reported over the last day or two that Forest are closing in on signing Henderson on a permanent deal. He's apparently their number one target as a goalkeeper. Obviously, we know that's a position they need to fill in, seeing as we had Henderson and Navas on loan this season, with Horvath being out on loan and Wayne Hennessy being the only goalkeeper at the club, pretty much, other than uh, George Shelby, the youngster. And with the games that Henderson did play for us last year on loan, we all see how much of a, a, a top-class keeper he is, especially in the Premier League, and he's only going to benefit the club. And um, I did make a video about it not long ago, it was my last video on the channel and it was speaking about is Dean Henderson going to be too expensive, not as in I don't think he's too expensive is what Man U would ask for him is, is what I was trying to put out there. And the fee that was being thrown around was about 30 million that Man U wanted and I think Forrest are going to pay it or at least come close to it, maybe with add-ons and things like that. Um, but anywhere between 20 to 30 million I think for an English international goalkeeper which he will become. Um, obviously he got a few caps already as well but he's a very good goalkeeper and listen goalkeepers win points they keep you in the league and um, he'll climb us up the league as well so apparently there's no complications to the deal obviously Henson wants to leave United he said that last year um, especially with a loan deal as well. I think everyone in their head really thought if Forrest do stay up, then Henderson will probably be the first one through the door and he's looking that way at the minute. So he wants to leave United, Forrest want him, United want to get rid of him as well. But the only thing that is keeping United from just securing this deal and getting rid of him is this contract situation with David De Gea. Now it's been well publicised that De Gea and United can't really agree on terms at the minute. Ten Hag wants him, United want him, but they're just not on the same on the same wavelength at the minute with uh, with the contract terms and obviously with Dean Henderson being technically their only goalkeeper other than Tom Heaton at the club then they need to keep him unless De Gea signs a contract which obviously they're hoping for but they, they can't be for certain but I think that's the only going to be the only hold I expect Henderson to be announced within the next maybe two weeks or so um, hopefully there's no hiccups our end get the deal done get him in get him the first one through the door let him go and have a nice holiday over pre-season. Hopefully he gets it, he gets fit because obviously he suffered with that thigh injury um, in January, I believe it was. And um, we would have missed him if it wasn't if it wasn't for the club going to get Navas. Uh, imagine if we had to deal with Hen Hennessy for the rest of the season. Which Hennessy's a good goalkeeper, but he's not on their two level, and I don't think he's that Premier League quality anymore. Drop a comment down below if you think that 30 million is a decent price for Henderson, and if there's any other signings you want me to cover or you think Forrest should go and get then drop it in the comments below like I said drop a like subscribe and until next time see ya